uh, up and down like you know a lot of kids like to play, uh, physical, um, and uh, have fun. You know, you have the 7-0 wingspan, and defensively they say you're probably the best wing in the draft. Uh, how, how does that translate over to the NBA? Um, you know, defense is well respected. You know, you got to play defense to, uh, to be able to get in in the game, and then you got to contribute offensively. And I feel like, you know, me being able to play defense is a great asset to a team uh, just to only make them better. How important is it for you to prove to the GMs and coaches uh, that you can shoot the, the three? Uh, well, they know, uh, you know, my shot is all the way broke. You know, it's, uh, has, it has gotten better. I keep shooting, you know. Um, the small things, you know, they pick up on, you know, technique, form, follow through, uh, how, how's the release and all those things. And, you know, from my freshman year coming into college till now, it's gotten a lot better. So they know that I can get better at it. So it's just, you know, am I willing to put in the work? What's your best offensive skill? <sighs> transition. I would say getting to the basket, finding my teammates in transition. Talk about like putting in the work. What kind of things have you done to improve that? Uh, I mean, obviously, you know, keep doing the things that I'm good at already. Just you know, tightening those things up. But uh, just doing a lot of shooting, you know, a lot of ball handling, you know, just to be able to create off the dribble, being able to, you know, uh, knock down an open shot if someone leaves me open. Uh, just building my confidence. With the success you had on defense, how do you think you can bolster a team like the Lakers, which needs help in that area? Uh. Say that again. How do you think you can bolster a team's defense? Uh, I mean, what team doesn't want defense? You know, uh, I feel like you know being able to come in and slow guys down is it contributes to any team, no matter what program, even if they win a championship. Sorry. Uh, so I feel like you know uh, me being able to play defense and being really good at it uh, is a big help to any team. Do you see that ultimately as your calling card in the NBA? Um. Yeah. I see that, you know, as as of now, yeah, I see that being my calling card, but no one knows what God has in store for us, so may God keep blessing me. What <laughs> yeah. have you been hearing in terms of where you might go in the draft? Uh, it's a wide range, first round, anywhere. <laughs> 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 when you work out for a team, even a team like the Lakers, what do you try to impress upon them? That I work hard, you know, whether it's – 100 people here, whether it's five people here, you know, just being able to work hard um, and be one of those guys that's willing to, you know, go uh, to beyond measures to be great. And um, it doesn't matter, you know, how, how you are in the game. You got to be able to work to get better because it's a lot of players that are great, but who's willing to go that extra mile to become even better? Are there any yeah. NBA players you can say you modeled yourself after or you admire or anything that you might have taken from anybody? I will say mentality-wise, Kobe, you know, uh, Kobe, Jordan. Uh, all those guys, you know, with that killer mentality to, that no matter who's on the court, uh, you're going to give it your all. You're going to go at them um, no matter what's the what's the case or what's the scenario. Um, and then, you know, it's guys like Kawhi Leonard that play defense, that knocks down an open shot, that, that's a hard worker. Um, I wouldn't say I play like him, but I said, you know, as far as, you know, teams looking for it, they'll say, oh, kind of reminds me of Kawhi, and I'll take it. <laughs> you went to Jimmy? Hmm? Still got the shimmy? Oh, yeah, of course. That'll never go away? No, so, never. <laughs> do teams ever ask you about it? Does that ever come up in the interviews? Or? Yeah, yeah, it, it has. What do they want to know? Why do you do it? <laughs> Why do you do it? And I say um, comfortability, confidence. Uh, Wrap it up, guys. Men, men lie, women lie, numbers don't. My, uh, <laughs> when I started doing it, my percentage went up. So, <laughs> how, how many workouts have you had and how many do you have coming up? Any, any teams in particular? Uh, you know, after traveling a while, you kind of like, Huh, huh, huh. On the spot right now, I don't know. So I'll say I probably got like five more. How many total with that? Roughly 12. 12. Yeah.